honor the memory of those who've gone before us and paid the ultimate sacrifice. And it's the spirit of a firefighter that we honor because of 343 on 9-11 and firefighters from that day forward and before have the same spirit of sacrifice that they're willing to give for their fellow man regardless of the dangers. And we've been doing many things over the years, but we're nothing more important and more proud of that we're building these specially adapted smart homes around the country for our catastrophically injured service members. Those are giving up three and four limbs for their country so you could stand here and not worry. I will tell you what you're doing today is so important. That we make sure in America that we never forget the sacrifice that was made on September 11th of 2001 but the sacrifice that has been made ever since by our men and women in uniform who have carried the torch on the war against terror. It's not talking about recently about our men and women in Afghanistan, Afghanistan and the sacrifice that they're making. But believe me, many of them are still coming home severely injured. And believe me, many will not come home. Um, I heard about this from a co-worker. My brother designed the shirts for it. Um, I thought the run was great. I definitely will be back next year. This is my first year doing it. Uh, I thought it was a great time and I'll be back every year. One of my uh, co-workers actually sent an uh, email to us the other day said he was going to do this and uh, thought it would be uh, very interesting to come down and do it with him. Um, I decided if I'm going to do it, why not just do it in full gear? You know, the firefighters in New York did the same thing before they even went to work. So I thought I would give it a shot see how it would work out. But I had, I had a blast, it was fun. Well, I'd definitely be back next year. I came out this year for the first time to do this run. I brought 11 kids from my church. A couple other parents went with me. We did the whole thing. We had a good time. It was a long ways, but we had a really good time, and I think the kids enjoyed it, even though it was long and tough for them. I plan on coming back next year. I don't know if the kids will come, but I plan on coming next year, too. And uh, once we did our run on Friday night, we jumped in the car, drove to Nashville, Tennessee, did their run Saturday morning, and uh, finished that run up, got some lunch, and headed to Cincinnati, Ohio, where we're finishing up the weekend. We are uh, just finished their second run, um, their second annual run this year, and we're headed to Savannah, Georgia next weekend, Raleigh, Durham the following weekend, and we're going to finish up at the big run in New York City.